Well, hey. I'm in Parno right now. I'm in Parno because I kind of... Well, I want to go on a trip. Well, I already am. I'm basically doing a northern Estonia trip. I'm right now just uh, chilling in Parno because... I don't know, I just wanted to come here, kind of. Next bus is to Hopsala. But I'll do a bit more... Well, I'll actually check out like places and stuff. Spent the first night there. From there on, I'll go to Tallinn. And... Take a train to, I suppose, Kivieli. From there on, I'll, I think I'll go to Norva. When I come back from Norva, I'll check out Silove and from there on I'll go to Tartu and, and then back to home. The purpose of this trip kind of is like um, is to get some experience for the actual trip I want to do. I've been planning to go to Eastern Latvia for for like two years now. I've wanted to do that. But I just don't have the proper opportunity and experience and I just wasn't, you know, too sure yet. But now I have a summer free and I decided to finally do it. And alone as well. It's uh, two solo trips. So yeah, the point of this trip is to get some experience first until I go to Latvia. So yeah, pretty much till 4 p.m. when I'm here. I should be in Hapsalo by 6 p.m. The reason why I want to stay in Hapsalo for a bit longer is that I want to... I don't know if I want to hike, but I kind of want to go to Rohugela. That's pretty much the port to Voramse. There's uh, some places around Rohugela that I would like to check out. So I would either walk or rent a bike. So yeah, as I, as I said, my current plan is to go from Berne to Hapsolo, stay there. Then from Hapsolo I take a bus to Tallinn. From Tallinn I take a train to uh, Kivieli. From Kivieli I walk uh, to Pusi, because there's a few interesting places there too. From Pusi I take the train to Norva. I kind of have the same plan with Narva as like Parana. Just, just like no specific place I want to go check out. So I'm in Hopsalo now. It's uh, 6.20. I'm gonna go to my uh, room to check in. Then go check out the city. Might as well check these little weird buildings out. What's this? Oh, an open building. I hope I don't stumble into. Homeless people. birds in here.
no clue what that was. Some kind of ventilation thing. I don't know. It's another random building. Here are these kind of weird small storage units, I guess. I don't know. I think this is, it is a storage. Not very interesting, I know, but whatever. Yeah, I guess this is just some random storage. Nothing else. Mm -hmm. But there's actually something else. Something different. A bird. This one's boarded off. Whoa. This goes to there. Which goes to that thing. I'm gonna guess this is something for like loading the boat onto the water. This looks cool though. Just like a big generator or engine. Guess I'm gonna go check the bigger buildings out. There is a building. Oh, it also has a camera. It seems to be in use. I'll just uh, avoid getting caught. or more storage I don't know. oh this was the kitchen this was the dining room then also seems like a foyer Freaking walls are just knocked down. I hope it doesn't risk the structural integrity of the building. Very touchy flooring. I'm not gonna bother. I don't know if I said it already, but this is um, army like uh, quarters or was. <laughs> it isn't anymore. I mean, it may be the land may be owned by the army, but 
definitely this building isn't being used <laughs> just that other building and the weird cell tower this is a cool ceiling design I'm guessing this was like a classroom or a workshop I'm not sure oh Nistrukci instructions protivoposharnoi bezopasnosti. I don't know. I don't know what that means. Probably like some kind of propaganda thing. I'm gonna guess this was sleeping quarters. busted in some places Maybe I could check out this little area too. Yeah, this has been a lot more trashed. Whoa. Okay, I've actually... Damn. Didn't think I would see it here. This used to also be the court. Actually found something interesting, interesting on the floor. It's a bunch of kids. I doubt it's from this place. I think someone just trashed their stuff in here. And accidentally threw that as well. Actually. Absolutely. Oh, I This is like confidential stuff. What the hell? Lost cash and those It's like a spec sheet for a gun. That's all I can say here. It's a handgun, Makarov. This one's an automatic Lil. Maybe there's more. I think that's mold on the floor too. Great. Sehne birokas. It's a recipe for a mushroom pie. Not interested. Lanema. Leak my guard. Bunch of those. I think the red couches are from here. Like the bigger furniture. I don't think anyone would bring that stuff here. Fucking bird. To there and under under the stage I guess or fishing nets storage 
Okay. Guess I'm gonna head back to my room and see you later. Good morning. It's the second day now. Today's plan is to uh, is to kind of go to Rogana, check some places out, and come back. Uh, after coming back, I will take a bus to Tallinn and then take a train to Kivieli, I believe. Then try to find somewhere to sleep there, uh, hostel or not. I mean, I have a sleeping bag if things get a bit dire. Right now I'm gonna go get some snacks or supplies for lunch and then try to rent a bike. All right. All right, got myself a bike. I'm renting it. And I'm on my way now. This path I'm actually taking is like... It actually used to be a railway that uh, went to Rohugela. The railway was like... Uh, pretty much they stopped uh, doing trains here and they took the rails up. It's as, as, much, as much as I know. And now it's been turned into a hiking track, pretty much. So, that's like one of the three possible buildings here. Seems like this was some kind of bunker slash uh, overwatch tower, or, you know, where they shoot with guns. Could be that too. The lower entrance is uh, walled off. I'm not sure why. All right, what we got? Seems like a fiberglass chair seat. Yeah, that's where they had the weird. There's the sea. Oh, it actually continues. That's the second building. I hope it holds. Oh. It's like a hangar type building. Not exactly hangar, but something like that. in here another like watchtower or something 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 Seems like these were like possibly garages. Guess I can go look at what's inside. Oh, it's also walled off. Great. I guess this is a bit of a bust. Oh, that's 
pretty much it, I guess. Fuck. Most of the stuff seems to be demolished. Might as well check this out. This was just garages again. The good thing about this place is that these places are quite close to each other. I see something else too. <coughs> like this is like a kilometer away from the last place. The next places are a bit further away. Well, What's here? Another garage. Alright. Uh, there's a loading area for a truck of some kind. Same here. There used to be more buildings, but most of them are demolished. I wonder if this like naturally just collapsed or was this part of like the demolition? They just didn't decide to finish here for, a re for some reason. Well, yeah, I don't know. Seems kind of boring here. <laughs> just nothing interesting. I gotta say. Whoa. And the roof is pretty busted. Quite anticlimactic. But hey, that's just how it is sometimes. Alright, I guess I'm gonna go to the next place. I think the next place pretty much is Rohokula. Oh, there's a dog. <laughs> Shit. Alright. Guess I can't go to the place that I really want to go to. Because there's a really angry dog. Hmm. Alright then. I guess we're gonna go back. I we'll have one more place. pretty much back on the railway well former railway you can see it just goes straight for a really long time I'm here as far as I know as far as I know this was a this place was built for the purpose of creating concrete or cement for, for to build the Hapsolo air airbase uh, for the military. I believe that's the, that's the reason for this place to exist. I think I'm gonna have my lunch now. Make makeshift lunch. I don't know. I'm gonna sit there. So for lunch I'm gonna have string cheese. That's what I'm gonna sit on. Sorry aunt. But you're in my way. Besides the string cheese, I'm also going to eat dried apricots. 
and and a chocolate bar. It's not very it's not a very great lunch, but it's good enough. After eating, I'm gonna I'm gonna see if there's anything else besides this building. So yeah, this is pretty much the place. Um, that's all I have to show you from Hopsolo, around Hopsolo. Uh, pretty much all of it was military related stuff. This did uh, the uh, concrete, they made the concrete for the military air base. Uh, then the cordons with the garage is pretty much, and then yeah, the cordon in the hop solo. Uh, I also wanted to check out a mansion, but it was right next to a, <clears throat> a house that was still in use, you know. Someone still lived there, and both of them were in the same uh, private lands. And there was a dog just open in the yard. Didn't want to risk it, so I didn't check it out sadly. Yeah, that's all I got to show you from Hopsolo. I, I uh, rearranged my plans for today. I'm not gonna end up in Kivioli by evening. I'm just gonna uh, stay near Dalin. I have a family member that lives there, so I can just stay the night there. And uh, by morning, I'll try to go to Kivioli, walk uh, to Era and to Pushi, and from there on, take a train to Narva and try to find uh accommodation in there to spend the night um yeah it seems like it's gonna take another three days this trip and it's gonna be nice this was the place it was it wasn't it wasn't that fun but it's still pretty cool i gotta say the latvia trip will surely be more interesting because just like a massive factory, there's schools, probably a manor. All right. Thank you.
Well, it's uh, day three now. Just uh, got off in the Kivirili station and I'm walking to the first location now. It's an industrial uh, small area with like three buildings, I think. Besides that place, there's another one in Kivirili, but it's basically just a random. I, I, I don't really know what it is, but it's just a big building. It's probably gonna be empty inside. So I'm not yet sure if I want to go check it out, because it's not that close, you know. After that, I think, I think I'm gonna just walk to Erra. There's like one or two places there. And after that, I walk to Pishi. If, if I remember, there should be a pretty big uh, industrial factory there too. It's like pretty, pretty big. So I'm pretty sure there's like security and stuff. But we'll see. I'm not sure yet. Alright, I'm gonna walk there and show you the place if I can get there. Alright, I've been walking this <coughs> abandoned uh, industrial railway a uh, bit, and I'm pretty much right here. Uh, there's uh, some kind of chemical uh, chemical plant in there. I'm suggesting it's for the fossil fuels. <coughs> Fortunately, there's a car right there, but I'm not sure if it's if it's just left there or just someone is here. Right now, it looks like it's just left there. Well, doesn't hurt to check out. I hope. Okay, I see. That's uh. Pretty fucked up car. Yeah, that's being left here. Oh fuck! This place is just tar. This place is literally just tar. Fuck. It's literally not even asphalt, it's just tar in the ground. Damn. Looks pretty busted up. Seems like it was a pretty tragic accident. Definitely was hit from the right side. Or maybe they rolled the car, I'm not sure. Let's close it up. <laughs> So my immediate guess is that this was like some kind of car repair place. I don't really know the terms for this stuff. Alright. Hard hat. Some kind of rubber stuff. Dials. Seems like a general storage room. Tires. Oh, it smells. It's that fucking... I don't know what's in English, but... I kind of want to have my lunch soon. With whatever I have in my bag, but... Not in the smell. Probably somewhere where I'm covered from the smell. Definitely not closer to that. Just another storage room. Oh, and this seems like another storage with some workbench kind of thing. Just a desk. Bringing this jacket was like a fucking mistake. I haven't even needed to use it. But it also doesn't fit in my back, so I just have to carry it with my hands the whole time. It's pretty annoying. Okay, we finally got something bigger.
Mitte sõitsed. Nii jää kurriid. Kurriids. Elektriik. Provier. Ispraaf. Noost. Zasjemljen. Ja. Kas te suust just a main? Main workshop room. I don't know what it says, of course. Electroenergy. I can understand, but nothing else. I think those were headphones, so like it was loud in here. <laughs> oh. Alright. The floor doesn't look very, uh, very good here. Yeah, this looks pretty unsafe. So this had a bunch of uh, furniture. I guess this was another workstation, workshop. Okay. Just gonna have to guess where the things are. It smells like a dirty toilet or something. I don't know. It's hard to explain the smell of burning, uh, whatever it's called in English. There's a sink, more furniture. Not bad. Oh, I just felt the floor just sink below me. And this looks fucking freaky, doesn't it? Second floor. All right. Sounds very good when you step on the floor, and this is does that sound very reassuring. It's just desks and shit like that. Sounds reassuring, especially the water damage. The door is so low, it's weird. Shower, I guess. Why is it so yellowed? I don't know. Yeah, the chair is literally it's just rotten. Plants growing on the floor. Looks like something out of Silent Hill. The movie. <coughs> Just a big room. With a roof entrance. I'd like to check out the roof. I believe the... Oh, stalactites or whatever they're called. Oh, it's tripping right now. Alright, I guess this was just another workshop area. It seems to be locked. I can go through the window. But it's just a fucking effort right there. Oh well. 
I'm gonna do it anyway. Looks chill. I could do my lunch here. Are those, uh, I have no clue what these are. I'm gonna guess lighting, lightning bolts, poles. There's like a shed over there, but that looks boring. I'm not gonna check it out. There's a, there's a basement, which is cool. I think that this was abandoned after this building. That could be the reason for the modern windows. All right, I'm gonna go inside. Oops, I'm just gonna have my lunch in that car seat in the storage room. It's more changing room. This one's pretty clean compared to the other one. Just a fucking pool of water. And I mean, this place is just leaking everywhere. So far, this place has not disappointed me. Time to do tiptoe again. Or maybe I'll check out the place first and then eat lunch, cause... I'm gonna go that way anyway, so... Yeah. continues but not over here it's just a storage should have expected that locked from the inside. I can see that. All right then. It's the entrance to the basement, I guess. The other basement. Storage, storage. Guess this was like some kind of painting, painting stuff here. Oh shit, that's bad. This doesn't have a solid floor. Cause there's, wait, maybe there isn't the basement. I'm not sure. This just seems like a smaller workshop. Yeah. That's it for this building, I guess.
Da. I just like caged off here. Well, that's it for this area. Weird chunk in here. I think we have our entrance. Still closed. Let's see. It's held in with a rope. There's a fox. There's a fucking fox in there. All right. mess over here. Our next preparation date. Maybe I could see the time or date. Not on this. Oh, this should have one. Excuse me. Okay, it's definitely here still. of sounds. This is dated at uh, 2021. So it's very recent actually. Huh. Interesting. Could actually still be in here somewhat. It's just a break room with even a furnace or whatever it's called, a heater. I just want to eat my lunch and get out of here. Go be a normal tourist. Check out the actual city. Oh, my stuff is still here. That's good. I'm gonna try to lock it as well. There we go. It's locked. Stupid person wouldn't even be able to notice that it's just held shut instead of locked. I call it I call it good enough. Alright. Time to go have my lunch. It was a bit empty, but not that empty. It was worth checking out, I'd say so. Uh, 
my plans have actually changed again. I'm not gonna walk to Pushi because I found out that there's no train going at the right time. So we basically just have to go back to Kiviri and take the express train. I already got a place uh, that I found in Narva to sleep in. I don't know what to do the rest of the day if I get there soon enough. All right, guess I'm gonna have my stupid lunch here. It's the poverty lunch, I guess. You could say. There's a worker right there. I think he's looking for me. I have a feeling. Well, my excuse is that I'm just taking photos. He just seems like a general worker, so. I don't think we're gonna have problems if he finds me here. All right, I chose not to. <clears throat> I chose not to wait just in case, cause I don't really want to mess with anyone. It seems like I was caught, and some worker is just looking for me. But even if I do have those all, all excuses that I didn't do anything, I just took photos and shit. He could still be an asshole and just. I don't know, call the police or something. I don't know. If, I don't want to risk that kind of stuff. So I just decided to get out of there and find another place to sit down and eat. Seems like I got away. Had my lunch. I walked all the way back to Kivieli, which was not very easy. Uh, no one's just waiting in the train station. The train's coming in like an hour. I'm not sure about tomorrow. I think tomorrow will be my last day on the trip. I, I may check out the Bushi factory, uh, but I don't think I'm gonna go to Silama because that's like a bit of a it's a bit of a stretch. Uh, Considering how I feel right now. Well, I don't, I don't feel bad. I'm just a little tired Well, I kind of cut the trip short Yeah, because of mm, me getting tired a little and I kind of reached the goal that I Wanted to have for this trip is to get experience for the Latvia trip And I think I got that pretty well uh, it's not like super difficult to get to places, but still, it's better to just be sure before taking a uh, bigger challenge. A lot of the other days.
I'm gonna go look for another one. I'm just gonna slowly walk towards the train station. See if we can have anything on my way. If that interests me. little bonus at the end. I'm gonna sh uh, show you the place that I first uh, posted about. Might have so show you in video form this time. The ceiling's in pretty bad condition now. Graffiti has been more, more graffiti has been added, and still pretty much the same from inside. Presumably, there was this is like a little theory that there probably was an entrance to something underground here. I mean, it kind of hints to it, but it's totally collapsed. I don't think it was a bunker. 
probably just some kind of workshop here's like grain silo or more uh, storage something for something <laughs> and down there are the houses oh well yeah looks pretty ugly This is fiddled with mosquitoes. That is quite vandalized. And this fucking thing has been turned into shreds. Yeah. Someone straight up went through this with a sledgehammer or something. Jesus Christ. Also on the roof. It's actually very weird and suspicious. That's where this is the lower floor of the other building. Pretty much the same, just bricks and graffiti. Alright, that's pretty much all I have to show you.